Welcome to Tanganyika Wildlife Park, where the encounters with wildlife inspire us to be stewards of conservation. Here, in the heart of this park, we witness the playful dance of seven six-month-old cheetah cubs, each a testament to life's resilience and beauty. Born to mothers Cassie and Zuri, these cubs entered a world that is increasingly fraught for their kind. Once roaming freely across Africa and Asia, cheetahs now find themselves vulnerable, their numbers dwindling due to habitat loss, human conflict, and the dark shadows of illegal wildlife trade. Within the safe confines of Tanganyika Wildlife Park, these cubs have grown from their fragile newborn state into thriving adolescents. Under their mother's watchful eyes, they've learned crucial survival skills, the art of the sprint, the thrill of the pounce, the joy of play. At six months old, these cubs have reached a significant milestone. They've been lovingly weaned from their mothers and now reside on exhibit here at Tanganyika. Their lives will continue to unfold under the caring gaze of our dedicated staff and other park employees. Their socialisation extends beyond their mother's care, introducing them to a variety of human faces and experiences. This critical step enriches their lives and ensures their care continues seamlessly as they grow. Each new interaction helps them adjust to their home here in the park. As we watch these agile cubs play, let's remember that they symbolise hope for their endangered species. Their presence here at Tanganyika Wildlife Park is a testament to our commitment to conservation, education and the preservation of this stunning species. Every day brings new experiences for these cubs, new challenges and new triumphs. Their journey is one of discovery as they learn more about their world and the humans who share it with them. But these cubs are not alone in their journey. Here at Tanganyika Wildlife Park, we're committed to providing a safe haven for numerous endangered species. Our mission extends beyond the care of these individual animals. It's about making a difference in the survival of their species. As these cubs grow and flourish under our care, they serve as daily reminders of the beauty of the natural world and our responsibility to protect it. They are ambassadors for their kind, teaching us about the fragile balance of nature and inspiring us to act. Thank you for joining us on this journey. We invite you to visit Tanganyika Wildlife Park, where wildlife encounters inspire stewardship of conservation of animals and our environment. Tanganyika Wildlife Park, inspiring stewardship through unforgettable wildlife encounters. If you like this video, please remember to like and subscribe to our channel, where you get to see up-close interactions. And don't forget to come visit. We promise that you'll walk away with unforgettable memories that will last a lifetime. Now, enjoy the play and wonder of these magical creatures. get the rope not the hand. The rope not the hand. Me. Oh, that's good. What that... a good boy. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta do it on camera. <laughs> it's, 
It's a good thing I sanitize this thing all the time. But you can't bite it. B bat versus bite. Say it with me. <laughs> and then cheetahs. So cats don't entirely have retractable claws. Like there's always going to be a little bit of the claw showing. Okay. But Everybody was jam-packed in.